for the person who's just thinking about getting into BI, what type of self-learning might they want to think about? What type of resources do you think would be helpful for them? And what type of tools do you think that they should be really focusing on? First of all, in terms of the skills that people should learn when they're maybe considering BI and analytics, that's changing in real time right now. Yep. And the big three are SQL, Excel, and a data visualization tool, not necessarily Power BI or Tableau, but maybe like one of the two. And of course there are others out there, but you wanna have a strong BI data visualization reporting tool kind of in your arsenal. I consider those the big three. Competing for fourth is maybe a, a skill like Python or something. I don't think that those are going away anytime soon. In terms of learning these skills, and especially if you're someone who is trying to find your first BI opportunity, you need to start kind of adopting the mentality of a professional athlete. I came from an athletics background way, way back when. I played soccer into college until my legs just said, you're done with this. But something that really resonates with me even today that I learned from when I was playing soccer more competitively is you learn from the best. So when I was playing soccer, I was watching Premier League games, Champions League games, World Cup. You're watching the best soccer players in the world so that you know what's possible. You know really what you're terrible at and you have something to strive for. And I think that nowadays you're starting to see that sort of influencer culture really permeate on something like LinkedIn. And I've got Power BI influencers that I follow religiously who are fantastic because you wanna know the people who are better than you, to keep it in soccer terms. You wanna know who the Ronaldos and the Messis are, but you also wanna know who are some people that are maybe where you wanna be like a year from now or two years from now. You wanna have a little bit more to that flavor profile, but you want to follow the best so that you know what to aspire to. Something else I like to say is, you know, art is theft. So, I mean, like you want to be able to steal and cherry pick other people's ideas and either make them your own or figure out how to put your own sort of twist on that. And I don't think that there's anything wrong with that. It's like, you'd be crazy to think that other basketball players who are coming up today aren't cherry picking Steph Curry and LeBron James and all of the, the amazing things that they do. Professional athletes learn from each other and challenge each other to be better. And I don't feel like there's anything stopping people that are learning or even working currently today in business intelligence or data science from doing exactly the same things. 